So my mom and I just used this uh, this restroom right here, and apparently uh, it has a QR code that you scan with your phone. Uh, you scan the QR code, and then you can get uh, toilet paper. So I've never seen that before. Kind of interesting. <laughs> Alright, that is the that's the second time. It, it always happens to my mom as well. I think Sorry. I think it's just because I'm so good looking, that's all. I was just saying, it always happens to my mom. They always ask my mom. I think it's because they're used to maybe seeing younger people a little bit more, but they're not used to, no offense, but they're not used to seeing older people as much. I get it, yeah. Um, sure. Yes. I get it. Here we go. <laughs> so we've arrived at uh, Tiananmen Square, um, but we were not at the usual front part of the square. We came around the side. Our taxi driver dropped us off on the side. So I've never been through this entrance, and we'll have to see if it's an actual entrance, right? Mm -hmm. Kind of a late start, but yeah. we'll try. We'll try. Turns out that uh, the guy was trying to help, but I'm quite certain that there's no like secret entrance that only he knows about. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're gonna walk around to the front right now and hopefully get in. There's some big crowds in the front, so might take a little bit of time. Will you give your seat? Okay. So I guess that's enough. I imagine that will suffice. Hang on, I gotta put your money away. Put, put things away. Don't fall into the thing there behind you. We didn't know that we had to get tickets from outside, and we did. They gave us this little receipt, and yeah, we are heading in now. I think this will suffice. How much was yours, Mom? 30. Yeah, so it's 34, what I imagine is old. Se old. <laughs> senior citizens, and 60 for us regular young people. Regular folk. I think it's a perfect match. My mom and I are it is, yeah. taking a bunch We're, of... Uh, compatriots? Com <laughs> yeah, well, it's, it's interesting because my mom loves uh, photography and oh, yeah. I love videography um, and photography, but more so uh, making videos. And so there's obviously a lot of overlap between those two disciplines. I mean, we use similar hardware. Uh, my mom's is more expensive than mine, but we use similar hardware just in general for videographers and for uh, for photographers. And I'm busy taking selfies. <laughs> and she's busy taking selfies. Yes. <laughs> yeah. 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 Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Ashley and I, we have already, uh, we've already made a video about Tiananmen Square and we will link it right here. Um, so unfortunately I can't tell you too much about it. Uh, we have all, you know, our last video we, we talked a lot about it. review of the Forbidden City. It's amazing. It goes on and on forever. It's incredible. It's definitely a UNESCO World Heritage Site. I believe it is. It is. It's yeah. very, 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 very cool. I'm glad I saw it. And Graham was a great tour guide.
one. We're gonna go? We gotta go. That was what they were indicating. So they kept pointing and I thought, yeah. 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 We're outside of Forbidden City and we are going back to the front so we can go to Tiananmen Square. No thank you. We're going to uh, Tiananmen Square and we're going to go see uh, the front part of Forbidden City where there's a photo of the big picture of Mao Zedong. Um, yeah. Anything else to add?